Hello everyone, today I'm going to be telling you a little bit how I put an intro on my Twitch. If you find this video helpful, please give it a like, a comment for the algorithm, and don't subscribe. So, adding an intro is really honestly uh, kind of a, subject, a subjective kind of creative process. Uh, you can do it many different ways, however you want to do it. So for what I did, uh, I'll play it for just a few seconds, uh, so you can watch it and kind of get an idea of what I'm talking about. So kind of what was going on there was I just had, that was for a Smash Bros event I was hosting. Uh, so I just went and created that mostly in Premiere Pro. Um, so you can really use any editing software, CapCut's free, uh, you can just find a free one. It doesn't have to be anything extravagant, um, but that's how I did it. Um, if you want, there's, there's even more simple ways to do it back in the day. Uh, I honest, I just put an image on the screen and I had OBS ca capture on a different screen, a timer on Google. <laughs> So it wasn't anything special. It wasn't a special video or anything. It was just a timer on Google with maybe some music playing. It's There's simple ways to do it, but I, I would suggest the best way to do it is creating a new scene. So as you see there, I had a starting soon scene. That makes it a lot easier for you to seamlessly switch between uh, your starting soon screen and your game scene. But your intro, you know, again, that's a subjective process. I put a timer, you could put whatever you want. You could put any video you want with a timer. You don't even have to do a timer. It's whatever you want. I would just say, put it on a scene and then have it just transition into your normal stream and then you go. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like, a comment for the algorithm, and don't subscribe.